so Rett syndrome is an excellent uh, genetic disease. It occurs primarily in girls, but there are also boys, a uh, small number of boys that are affected. Um, and the main symptoms are in these children, they develop normally until about six to 18 months of age. And then at that point, there's a um, decline or a lack of progression in their function and observed um, most often in ability commu to communicate, which includes using um, their motor function, their hands to point at things, eye gaze to say what they want. Um, they lose their um, ability for spoken communication. Um, and then they develop stereotypical hand movements as well in place of their normal motor function. Um, <clears throat> it also is accompanied by features in most patients, such as seizures, um, in addition, there's due to the motor function loss uh, can lead to scoliosis and more severe gross motor impairment as well. Um, <clears throat> it's a lifelong disease, so um, affects young girls and uh, women as well. And then, as I mentioned, a small number of boys, really no effective treatments. Um, a lot of these patients take medications for their seizures which can be very debilitating, but no treatments currently available to treat Rett syndrome or the core symptoms of Rett syndrome itself.